Welcome to another video. In this video, we'll create a box plot using the new statistics chart in Excel. For this video, I already prepared the data that I'll be using, and I will show you how to do a single box plot first, then multiple box plot together. So let's start by selecting the age, for example, for the male, then we're going to go to statistics and choose the box and whisker. Simple as that. We have the box plot and similar to any chart in Excel, we can choose how you want your data set to look like. And you can see it shows first set male and the major values. Now going to data series for example here you can see several features and I'm going to talk about the coloring it's similar to any chart in Excel if you want to show the mean line which is over here and how you want to do the calculation if you want to show the mean markers we choose the marker in the middle. We just change the color so you can see it better. Okay. So mean line. You can see the mean line. Choose the line here. The mean markers. Once I add it, you will see it in the middle. Showing the inner point, if you want to show all the points that you have in the set, which I don't recommend. So let's remove that. Okay. Now, what happens if we have an outlier? Let's go over here, and I'm just going to type a value that's far away from the rest of the data. And you can see that the box plot automatically changes, and you have the outlier over here. Okay. because we had this checked show the outlier point if I take it out so you don't see it it removes it from the data but of course if you want to keep it you will see that you have the box plot and you have the outlier which pushes the box plot down now if I want to do two box plots together to compare the data is first delete this box plot and I'm going to come over here and choose both sets of values male and female so as you know when I compare them we go over the same place and we simply choose the same box and whisker plot and Excel will determine that you have two data set we'll choose different colors for each one and you can see we still have the outlier for the male Let's remove that. So now we don't have the outlier. We can simply compare both sets. Okay, let's choose this, and you can see that we have the male, female, and you can compare the box plot, the median, the maximum, minimum, the first quartile. You can see that the first quartile for the female is higher. The second quartile is higher, the range of the data for the female is higher, and you can see that the 50% of the female are more widespread than the 15% of the female, and so on. And again, you can change the colors of each one individually. You can specify what you want for each one individually, inner point, mean line. You can change the color. You can change the color for the second one. And of course, chart title. You can change anything you want, similar to the other videos that we did with different charts. It's the same property, all the same features and layout 
as other charts. So if you're looking for the other modification of the chart, refer to my other videos on pie chart and bar graph, and you can see how we can change the colors, chart titles, and other features of the chart. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and look for more videos on my channel.